This is my home and I'm going to show you how to cook some fantastic home cooking dish. You will love it. Yes, let's do it. Hi lovely people of YouTube. In great demands, you've been asked, can we have a more mushrooms recipe? Of course you can have a more mushrooms recipe. Mushrooms and polenta. Yes, the traditional way. First of all, let's cut some nice pancetta. Just need to remove the lovely skin and make sure you cut them in slices, not too thick, chop them very fine. Now, this lovely smoked garlic, just one clove, cut it in little slice, little chili. Yes, that goes. Use about six, seven, eight spring of a time. Let's start to slice some of the mushrooms. King oyster first. Grab some butter mushroom, cut them in half. Gallinacci or girol. And also hydrate some porcini and make sure you use the stock. Look at that. Tomato, just a few. Slice lengthway. It's about 10 tomato. Okay, let's start to cooking now. So simple. Olive oil, always abundant. Pancetta first. 100 gram of a pancetta. This stage, don't cook too much. Just about half a minute. You have the garlic, which is smoked garlic, or just ordinary garlic. Inside. Chili. Time. Then I'm gonna put some stock inside. Make sure you cook a little bit of tomato. Just add a little bit of water of the mushrooms. Plus, we take some of the mushrooms. It's about 20 grams of dry mushrooms. That's what you need. Just season a little bit. Salt and pepper. Now we go to the mushroom. Little button mushrooms goes in first. Yeah, shiitake mushrooms goes in. Girol. Oyster mushrooms. And I need a little bit of stock inside. I need some parsley. Handful of a parsley. Let's see cover. And let's cook it for about 10 to 12 minutes. Look at this. Let's move it for a minute. Let's cover. Let's do the polenta now. So easy. Inside here, because I do for four people, I put 800 milliliters of water. That would be enough for four. And 200 grams of polenta, which is 50 grams for a person. Working fantastico. Right, what do you need to do? You need to put about one knob of butter straight in, little pinch of salt. Okay, and start to stir it. Make sure that the butter disappears. Right, the water is boiling, it's the polenta. And slowly, 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 you have them inside. Don't put them all together, just to let it like it rain, like a phantom. This quick polenta will take us about five minutes, but we're gonna take less. At this stage, it's ready. So move off the gas, use some nice grated parmesan, two tablespoons of parmesan, one and one, two. Another knob of butter. Stir it. Hi, ah, it's so hot, I forget to grab it. That is ready. 
my lovely mushroom salts. Mushrooms. Look at that. Just want some parsley. What a feast! This is how they used to eat the polenta. Polenta went straight on in the middle of the tables. Many, many spoons around, or wooden spoon. This is how I made it. This is all made by hands. Look, my lovely spoons. I made it, this one. Fantastic. And all used to enjoy it together. So, wood or spoon? Wooden spoon or fork? Wooden spoon or fork? I made that, I used this one. If you wanted to see me make more of this fantastic, delicious dish, don't forget to subscribe. It is free. Let's enjoy it all together. This particular one, it is polenta with wild mushrooms. I love you all!